So I just came home from school. We were talking about how there's a lot of laws protecting minors from sexual abuse or sexual harassment. And then he said, guess what? So nanti korang nak rogol, janganlah rogol yang bawah 18. Korang rogol lah yang atas 18. Malaysian student Ain was shocked when a teacher made a rape joke in class. And the girls were like quiet, but the, the boys, oh, they were laughing like it was so funny to joke about raping someone. She raised it with another teacher. But he just says that, oh, you're a girl, so you, you're emotional and sensitive. This thing is sensitive because it's a rape joke. It's a rape joke, somebody's trauma. How could I not be sensitive over it? She called out her teacher's behavior on social media and many responded, supporting her stand against rape culture, even writing songs about it. Make school a safer place for every girl in Malaysia. It also prompted others to share stories of harassment and inappropriate behavior in schools. We want to stop this here. We want to educate. We want to change. But there was also a backlash against her for speaking out. Some said she was making too big a deal of the incident. Responses also included inappropriate comments about her body. It made her sad, but at the same time, it gave us a proof that our culture, our society, we need to rectify this, come out from that kind of uh, way of thinking. Then, a friend forwarded a WhatsApp conversation among her schoolmates which took the issue one step further. It scared me so much, I cried. Ayn and her father took the matter to the police, but their response only generated further controversy when a senior official referred to the issue as what may be a joke by her schoolmate. The boy and his family apologized. Then, on her father's Facebook account, this comment appeared, apparently from the principal of her school. I am being let down by all these adults all these educators that obviously should know better than me, should obviously know better than us 17-year-olds. The principal has denied posting the comment and said her account was hacked. Malaysia's education ministry says the teacher who made the joke has been transferred elsewhere while the matter is being investigated. But Ayn hasn't returned to school, saying she doesn't feel safe there. Despite the difficulty she's faced, her father says he is glad she spoke up. This little girl that I brought up from a baby. Wow, she has this brave all this while in her. I cannot express her how proud I am. 